The Gene Pattern Notebook environment unites the capabilities of the Jupyter Notebook environment and the Gene Pattern platform to provide powerful analyses within the flexible notebook environment, all without the need to write code. To demonstrate, we'll create a new notebook. As an example, we'll use a recent study that aimed to improve outcome prediction for medulloblastoma, the most common pediatric brain tumor, through integrating five clinical and molecular data types via a Bayesian machine learning algorithm. We'll illustrate the step in which a gene expression dataset from medulloblastoma samples representing six subtypes is projected from the space of genes to the space of pathways using a gene pattern analysis module. From the Jupyter Notebook environment main page, pull down the New menu and select Notebooks, and whichever version of Python you have installed. This will create a new gene pattern notebook, which will open in a new browser tab. Here you see the familiar Jupyter Notebook interface, including the Jupyter menu, providing access to the notebook capabilities. To build a new notebook, you add cells containing different types of data. So, in our new notebook, we add the title, description, abstract, and summary of the analytical steps, as well as graphics and table data. The formatting capabilities in Jupyter Notebook are made available through Markdown. With the Gene Pattern Notebook extension, we have improved upon the capabilities of the existing Jupyter Markdown cell to allow users to create formatted text directly, as they would in a word processing program, without the need to know Markdown. Now we'll demonstrate the additional capabilities that the Gene Pattern Notebook environment provides. First, we need to create a new Gene Pattern login cell. To do so, select any blank cell and change that cell's type to Gene Pattern using the cell menu found in the Jupyter toolbar. Once inserted, the cell will prompt you to select an available Gene Pattern server and log in. If you do not have a Gene Pattern account, you can register from this cell as well. Note that all Gene Pattern servers are free to use. Now we will add a gene pattern analysis module to our notebook by clicking the gene pattern button on the left of the screen and choosing one of the available analyses on the server to which we have connected. You can browse all of the available modules by scrolling through the alphabetized list, or you can search for modules by category, keyword, or name. We then fill in the necessary parameters and datasets and click run. This will collapse the cell where the parameters were entered and create a new cell where the status of the job and then the job results will be displayed. To expand a collapsed cell, simply click on the plus sign in the upper right hand corner. Previously, researchers who wanted to include their analyses in a notebook would have had to do so through written code. Gene Pattern Notebook removes that requirement providing hundreds of methods for the analysis of genomic data. Once the module has finished running, the results can be sent to other gene pattern cells using the UI, or they can be accessed by programming users via Python, just as you would use any other Jupyter Notebook results. This is another way in which gene pattern analyses integrate seamlessly into the flow of a notebook. To demonstrate the programmatic use case, we'll use Python to view the PDF output, which shows the level of pathway activation after projection of the medulloblastoma subtypes gene expression data into that space. As we've seen here, the Gene Pattern Notebook environment is both powerful and easy to use. Gene Pattern Notebook is also easy to access and run. We have developed the Gene Pattern Notebook resource, an online site where you can develop and share your own gene pattern notebooks, as well as access example notebooks. For those who want to run gene pattern notebooks locally, we provide two methods for installation. If you are looking for a complete off-the-shelf installation, we provide a Docker image that can be run using the Kitematic application. This requires the least amount of manual configuration. Those who prefer the manual approach can install the Gene Pattern Notebook extension via the PIP or Conda package management systems. You've now been introduced to the Gene Pattern Notebook environment, 
a seamless integration of the gene pattern interface and the Jupyter Notebook, and have been shown how easy it is to use and install for non-programming and programming users alike. For more information, tutorials, and examples, please visit genepattern.org slash genepattern-notebooks.